everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about the cross selling in audio 17 sales module. Cross selling is a sales technique involving the selling of an additional product or services to an existing customer. Let's say we have received an order from the customer for laptop. So if the salesperson sells a complimentary laptop back to um, go along with it, it qualifies as a cross selling. So let's see how can we manage the cross selling in Odoo 17 sales. Cross selling also helps to upsell the productivity or the profitability of a business. You can just head into the sales module where you can consider the product which is laptop. So let me consider the product laptop as my main product. And in order to cross sell the items, let's move on to the sales where we have a, a section to upsell or cross sell the item like uh, we can say the optional product. So here I'm going to uh, set the optional product as, as laptop bag and mouse uh, for cross-selling the laptop. I mean cross-selling the optional product. So let's move on to the orders and we have just received an order from the customer. Here you can set the customer who is Azure Interior, uh, our frequent customer who is trying to purchase a laptop. So as the uh, customer tries to purchase a laptop, the order will suggest um, different product such as a complimentary product um, of the laptop. So even if the customer not uh, wish to buy or thought of buying additional products with a laptop, we are making a reminder um, to the customer to get the additional accessories of the laptop. So uh, the customer can buy a laptop bag or a mouse along with uh, the laptop. So if the customer is buying or placing an order for the laptop bag or mouse or other additional accessories along with the main product that is uh, the intended product laptop, then we uh, can consider it as a, a cross-selling strategy. So here um, the customer is placing order uh, along with the optional products of laptop, uh, I mean laptop bag and mouse. So you can confirm uh, all the products. So once you confirm, everything will be automatically configured under the order lines. And yeah, that's cool. And let's save this and let's confirm the order. So this cross-selling would allow us to upsell the profitability of a business because um, actually the customer has had no intention of buying the optional products of uh, such as the laptop bag and mouse. But using the cross-selling strategies, we could um, entirely boost the profitability of a business. So let's make delivery of the item to the customer. So you can just click on validate button so that you can just end with your delivery. And now we are going to request uh, for the payment uh, from the customer. So for that, first we have to generate an invoice where you can just create a regular invoice. And yeah, let's confirm. So once the invoice is confirmed the invoice will be moving from its draft state to the posted state now finally we are going to request uh, for the payment from the customer side so that you can just click on register payment where you can choose the journal uh, payment methods and you can find the amount as well as the payment date and memo everything is shown over here now let's create the payment and after reconciliation the payment will be moving to the bank so it's very easy to manage with the cross link in Odoo's 17 sales module. So hope this concept is clear for you. As always, stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.